industrial production of ammonia. Ammonia is produced on a large scale by the reaction between nitrogen and hydrogen under high pressure and optimum temperature in the presence of a suitable catalyst. This method is known as Haber process. Hydrogen is obtained by reacting methane with steam or through the cracking of oil and nitrogen by fractional distillation of air. The mixture of nitrogen and hydrogen going into the reactor is in the ratio of 1 is to 3. The gases are pressurized to about 150 to 300 HEM inside the compressor. The pressurized gases pumped into a tank containing beds of iron catalysts. 450 to 500 degrees Celsius is a compromised temperature producing a reasonably high proportion of ammonia. In these conditions, hydrogen and nitrogen will react to form ammonia. When the gases leave the reactor, they are hot and at a very high pressure. Ammonia is easily liquefied under pressure as long as it's not too hot and so the temperature of the mixture is lowered enough and so the temperature of the mixture is lowered enough for the ammonia to turn into a liquid. The nitrogen and hydrogen remain as gases even under these high pressure and can be recycled. And two on reaction with 3H2 reversibly forms 2NH3 and heat. The state at which the rate of backward reaction equals the forward reaction is called equilibrium state. Reversible reaction do not stop itself. These chemical reactions take place in both directions. At a particular temperature, the reactants and products reach at an equilibrium state. The following changes get unseen. The changes in concentration, temperature and pressure influence the equilibrium state. The result of the changes due to the change in these factors was predicted by a scientist named Le Chatelier.